Now I'm going to show you how, how you add an event to your calendar in Soko. Uh, you pick the day and you can just double click it or you can also just right click on it and a new event and also up here there is this button new event and then this window comes up so here you write the title for it it's a meeting for Soko and the location it can be whatever meeting room there is like a meeting room in Hoskolotork you can actually pick a category and here's the meeting or here you can flip through your calendar and I'm going to use this personal calendar because that's my working calendar we recommend that it use uh, the personal calendar as your default working calendar now here you can click through if it's an all-day event or if it's between it's between 10 and maybe 11 11 30 and here you can actually click show time as free but if you do that then uh, people that are trying to get a meeting with you on the same time they will see you as you are free but but you want them to see that you're busy because you are on another meeting and we do not want to repeat this if it's a meeting that is repeated weekly then you can just click on it here but in this case it's just this one time and if I want a reminder I would like uh, one day before and here you can write a description about this meeting and here I've added a description up here you have a few options we, we, I'm gonna start with by showing you this invite attendees and uh, here you can type in the name or the email address and uh, Soka will will look it up online so to make the list shorter I just have to write more and I'm gonna invite this one I can see Hugo Johan is available in this time I'm just going to show you how it looks if I pick another day like the 15th and I can see it comes dark here like it says down here busy then this time would not be good for Hoku to to come to this meeting but I want this to be on the 16th and then I just press OK and here you can pick the privacy for this event those privacy can be set up for each calendar by itself and I will show you that in another video you can attach a link to uh, some web page or to a picture online or something and always remember here to save and close and now you can see that the meeting is here if I double click on it I can even change the settings invite more people and so on you can even see that Kedvimar is now busy in this time slot since we created this meeting.